Playwright 151 is out, and if you're using LLMs and AI for your Playwright scripting, it comes with a real feature highlight. Whenever you now face a failing test case, Playwright will add this little copy as prompt button to the HTML report, to the trace viewer, and even UI mode to provide you a pre-filled LLM prompt that contains the error and all the context that might be required to solve this error. Let's check out the new feature. We are here in VS Code, and this is pretty much the example code that you get when you initialize a new Playwright project. This first test case here navigates to playwright.dev and checks if the page has the correct title. So let's break this and let's see what prompt Playwright will provide when we look into the HTML report. Here we have our failing has title test case. And when we check the error here, here we have this new copy prompt button. So let's copy it and let's see what's included. We could now paste the prepared prompt into Claude or ChatGPT, but I prefer to use Copilot Chat because the formatting is just a bit nicer. So we're here back again in VS Code, we're using Claude 3.5. And when I now paste everything, let's see what we get. Our prepared Playwright prompt includes some base instructions to set the stage. So the following Playwright test failed, explain why, be concise, respect Playwright best practices, and provide a snippet of code with a fix if possible. Then we have some test info, the error details that you know from the command line telling us what actually went wrong. Here we have an entire page snapshot, including the accessibility tree of the page that we were just testing. Here we have our test file with an inline error. Here we have a git diff, which I see because I turned on the also new capture git info flag in my Playwright config. And here we have Copilot's answer. So overall, this is a very extensive prompt and I probably wouldn't have put together so much information, but with all this, Copilot or Claude was now able to detect that we have a typo here and we can apply the fix right within VS Code. And here we go. All right, do your thing. This looks pretty good. But will this extended LLM prompt now solve all your Playwright errors? I don't think so. Feeding a page snapshot and all the Playwright context, of course, is very helpful to get good LLM answers and results, but you will be the only person to know if a website or some UI is doing what it's supposed to. And sometimes it's not about fixing a test, but fixing the actual feature. To create good end-to-end -end tests, there's just a lot of context required. And of course, the Playwright team also doesn't know what I want to test but I will adopt this copy prompt button and I will let you know how it goes in a future video.